Hello, hello, hello. All right. So this is a bit of an update video. Well, it's not really an update video. It's about one thing in particular, and that is paid content, which for those of you who listened to my last update video, uh, you know that I was somewhat aggressively pursuing or at least looking for avenues um, to make content like that, specifically to make content that I didn't feel comfortable putting for free on YouTube. Um, whether it be because it's of a certain topic that I don't want to put on YouTube, or it's because it's um, something like financial domination, which I get a lot of requests for, which I don't believe in putting out for free. So we have a number of avenues, and I've recently, um, I've got the content all together and ready to go. Um, I've been looking into opening a Clipster sales store, and they take about 40% of everything. So... All of the videos are now made, at least the first 10, because they require you to have 10 videos made in advance. Uh, but the weird thing is, is that uh, on that website, the word hypnosis and all of its variations are banned. So I can't actually describe any of my hypnotic files using the word hypnosis or hypnotic or anything like that, um, which is a little weird. Uh, that said, though, that said, um, YouTube also offers paid content, which I have now managed to enable, which didn't cause me nearly as much headache as fan funding. Um, so what I'm thinking of doing is, in addition to uploading stuff onto Clips for Sale, I'm going to upload the paid content onto this channel. Um, and the idea being that the files that are paid for are going to be roughly... I, I don't know. I'm looking between five and ten dollars. I think um, the videos are roughly twenty-seven to thirty-five minutes long each, so they're not exactly short. Um, but I'm thinking what I'm going to do is, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to upload them here. I'm going to upload them clips for sale. I'm going to look for other places to upload them to because I like having a. I don't like relying only on one source for everything. Um, so what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to, like, I think I'm going to upload all the videos here that are paid content um, when I upload them over there. Um, they're going to be roughly between, like I said, between 5 and $10. Um, they might be more than that, but only if they're really long, I think. I think, ten like, $10 for me is perhaps the good medium, I think. I feel like that's a worthwhile price. Um, so I'm kind of interested in doing that. YouTube also offers like a rental slash subscription model, but I don't really like that. Um, I don't like the idea of people having to continue paying for my files every time they want to listen to them. That seems really like wrong for, for what I'm doing. I'd rather you be able to buy the file and I, the only reason like buy the file, download it yourself, things like that. Um, like, that that's that's kind of what I would like to do, um, which is why I was looking for something like Clipster Sale, which I could sell the files, and you could actually download the files and take them. YouTube, there are ways to do it on YouTube, like there are extensions and browser plugins and all kinds of things that allow you to download videos, but I don't think it's an option. Like, I don't think putting a video up on YouTube for pay will ever allow you to download it yourself, which is kind of weird because I really wish you could, so if you guys do that, I don't mind. Um, it's not going to be something I'm going to mind or care about all that much if you do it. Um, but that said, that said, um, yeah, so, the files are ready. I'm going to up start uploading them pretty soon. Uh, I just wanted to upload this video and be like, hey, this is what I'm doing, this is what I'm going to be doing, things like that. Um, I should probably answer a couple questions I've gotten since I've started doing this. The first question being, does this mean you're no longer making free content? And the answer is no. Um, I'm absolutely making content. I'm going to continue making free content. That's not at all... Like, the idea of making paid content wasn't to sorry, wasn't to take away from the free content. In fact, the way I see it, it's a, like a symbiotic relationship where the free content, I, I'm assuming that of the free content I produce, of all the people who like that, maybe 1% are going to want paid content. And so 
that 1%, it's going to have the option of having paid content. And maybe some people who see the paid content are going to be like, oh, I want to check out the free content. So I see it as kind of a, like, working into each other kind of thing. Where the free and paid content sort of work together. Um, my goal is, personally, to get at least one free video and one paid video up a week. Like, that's my goal. Um, I can't guarantee that that's going to happen. As you know me, I sometimes release like five videos a week, and other times I release no videos for like two weeks, uh, depending on what I'm doing. But I think what I'm going to do is I'm trying I'm going to try and release like a free video and a paid video every week. That's my goal. Uh, so two videos a week. Um, and I might release less paid videos and more free videos as time goes by, um, depending on like depending on how many requests I get for things that I can only make in paid videos. Um, but yeah, so that's kind of my thing right now. My, my, my thing is essentially I want to make both, and I want to do both, and I want to be able to offer it to everybody that I can. Like, that's, that's the goal. The goal is to get it to everyone who needs it. Um, anything else I need to talk about right now? Uh, like, I sort of have been kind of working hard, kind of stressed out, trying to get everything to work the way it's supposed to. Um, that's been my life recently, is uh, panicking over, like, panicking over what videos I'm going to make, what video, if they're good enough, how are they going to work, you know. I, I stress out way too much. <laughs> I'm so stressed out way too easily. Um, but yeah, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to upload them to YouTube. Uh, I'm going to upload them to uh, Clips for Sale. I'm going to look for other places to upload them. Uh, like I said, they'll probably be between five and ten dollars. Like that's my goal: just do between five and ten dollars. Um, I don't like. I can't imagine unless it's like really long. I might go above that. Like if I recorded a sixty-minute video, I might do something like above that. Um, but yeah, uh, I'm kind of looking for like if I'm going to upload something. Like if I'm going to make something paid, it has to be either it has to be worthwhile of my standard. I think. Like, I think I have, like, a, like, if I'm going to make someone pay, or I'm going to say, hey, pay for this, I want it to be worth people's money. Um, so that's kind of a, a major concern for me, which is partly why I've been stressed out so much. Uh, but everything should be ready to go. I just have to start uploading things. Um, this, up, this video is obviously going to go upload first. And then once this video is uploaded... I'm going to start uploading the paid content. And so there's going to be a quick sort of... Um, I guess, glut of paid content when I upload, like, ten paid content videos all at once. And then, once I do that, it's going to go back to free content and, um, or alternating between free and paid content, depending on how much I get. Probably more free content than paid content, um, but I'm going to produce it, at least. Anyway, um... When the videos are up on my Clips for Sale site, I'm going to put that link in the description here. Um, there's also going to be a link to my email, which you guys can email me ideas, feedback, etc. if you feel more comfortable doing that. Um, honestly, I'm way easier to contact via email than I am via messages, honestly, because YouTube's message system is terrible. It doesn't tell me when to get messages, so I have to remember to check them every time. Um, anything else? I think that's it. Anyway, I hope everyone's doing well. Thank you for 3,000 subscribers. Hopefully we're going to grow further than this. Um, I'm looking forward to this. I'm looking forward to doing new ideas. I'm looking forward to being able to do ideas that I otherwise wouldn't be able to do. So thank you, everybody, and uh, let's hope this all goes well. Feel free to send me emails, messages, uh, give me ideas of things you'd like to see, give me ideas of things you want to see more of, things like that. All right, have a good day, everybody.